The ability to pull up is a testament to true strength, which is why the average person can't even do one. Until now, of course. If you're starting from zero, I'll show you how to get your first pull up. If you have weights, single arm rows can be a great way to build pulling strength, making sure to pull straight to the hip each and every time. Also notice how I'm controlling the negative and letting my shoulder, arm, and lat fall into a smooth protraction to increase that range of motion. But let's say you don't have weights. Bodyweight rows work just as well. You'll notice that I'm pulling to the middle or lower portion of my chest each and every time, while I'm also engaging my back muscles at the top of the rep. And again, just like with the single arm rows, I'm falling into a smooth protraction, really controlling the negative portion of the rep. As we're increasing our strength with these body weight rows, we're going to progressive overload by adding full body tension to our working muscles, paying specific attention to squeezing our thighs, core, and ankles together for the duration of this exercise. And we're going to increase the intensity even further by laying closer to the ground. This is going to challenge you on a whole nother level, but the reward is a defined back. Now let's talk about how we hold the bar. Please avoid a weak and unstable grip like the one being shown in the video. Instead, aim to have your pinkies grip the bar first. Make sure your pinkies stay stable with the rest of your fingers and have your knuckles facing up. Now that we have the grip, let me introduce you to scapular pull-ups, which can be done every single pull day. The idea of this exercise is we're going to be drawing our shoulders down and back, engaging the proper scapular muscles, giving you a more stable pull-up. If you're having trouble hanging or progressing further, a resistance band is the tool to use. They are affordable and simple to use. Simply tie the band around the bar and step into it with one leg or two. Depending on the size of the band, this will eliminate a lot of the stress and load on your joints, making it possible for anyone to practice perfect form. Which is exactly what we'll be doing in these assisted dead hangs, making sure to apply full body tension, aiming to increase our grip strength. Jump up to the top of the bar, we're going to do assisted static holds, pausing for a moment before we fall into a smooth negative portion of the rep in what we call assisted eccentrics. Specifically paying attention to lowering your body for 4-6 to six seconds on that decline while engaging the proper back muscles. Now we're starting to build a serious amount of pulling strength, so we're going to be doing static holds followed by eccentrics, but this time without the band. The reason we work eccentrics is because during that negative portion of the rep, our body is at our strongest. So eccentrics can become a great tool for practicing strength for the latter half of the movement, but only because we've built the strength to use eccentrics. You wouldn't do a one arm pull up eccentric trying to master that and you haven't even done a pull up yet. If you're able to do consistent static holds and eccentrics with just your body weight, it's safe to say you can rep out a couple of assisted pull ups. Should we remain hollow or arched at the top of the rep? Neither of them are wrong as they train different things, but since we're just starting out, we're going to do the arched position. Don't forget the body cues we've talked about till now. Arching your back at the top of the rep, maintaining a controlled eccentric, and applying full body tension through the duration of the exercise. When done properly, pull-ups can become an excellent marker of health and a great exercise for building the entirety of your back while strengthening your core, arms, and even in some instances, your chest muscles. I hope this video helped you guys. Please don't forget to check the description to see the three week pull up program I'm giving to you for free. Now go get your first pull up and don't forget to send me your progress. Strict form only.